كان يرجو لقاء ربه فليعمل عملا صالحا ولا يشرك بعبادة ربه أحدا <تصفيق> فينيشت كهف أوه هذا شو يس السلام عليكم بويز اند جيرلز ويلكم أهلا وسهلا ومرحبا تو مدرسة تي في شو ذيس إز ا شو وير وي برينج مدرسة تو يور سكرينز بويز اند جيرلز ماي نيم إز أستاذ حمزة And I was just finishing my Surat Al-Kahf. Alhamdulillah, I finished it. Boys and girls, boys and girls, be honest with me. Tell me, have you, have you, have you read your Surat Al-Kahf? Today is Friday, boys and girls. Today is Friday. Today is Jum'ah. What a blessed day, mashaAllah, tabarakallah. Let's start this day by sending salawat on the beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Say with me, Allahumma, salli ala Muhammad wa ala ali Muhammad. كما صليت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد اللهم بارك على محمد وعلى آل محمد كما باركت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد ما شاء الله تبارك الله سي الله أوف يو سينج يس 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 أنا أسيون ون أوف يو سينج يس أني هافن ريد إت يت No problem. Boys and girls, today's Quran segment is going to be a special Surat Al-Kahf one. I need someone who never read with me before. I'm going to take one of you and read this surah. No, not the entire surah. I'm going to read a few verses of Surat Al-Kahf with you word by word, inshallah. Yeah? Still hot. Yeah, still hot. So, I'm going to be doing that. I want all of you to join me in and recite Surat Al-Kahf. When you come back in the next segment, I'll show you the verses that we are reciting from Surah Al-Kahf. We're only going to recite a few verses. If you can recite them, حياكم الله. If you can't recite them, تفضلوا. Come along, inshallah ta'ala, give me a call. Oh, give me a call on the number here, so I can get you to recite with me. We are both going to be reading it together. Boys and girls, may Allah bless you. Let's have a look at this before we start the show. I'm going to take you to calligraphy class and show you something beautiful. We're going to come back for Surah Al-Kahf segment, inshallah ta'ala, boys and girls. Live on YouTube. Are you live on YouTube? Maryam is. Riyaz. Riyaz is. Imran. Salih. Ikram. Safiya. Farfura. MashaAllah. Who else? Who else? MashaAllah. Dhikra. Who else is there? Someone's name is Shock. Everyone. MashaAllah. Tabarakallah. And of course, Adnan and Amira there as well. Abdullah is there. MashaAllah alayki, Abdullah. Hayyakallah, ya Abdullah. For those of you who are live, someone is saying me. Marwa is live as well. Yalla. There's a share button right underneath this video. We'll likely share the button. Uh, hit the share button and share it, inshallah ta'ala, on your WhatsApp status. Uh, say, live with bunny, lol. And then you share the link, inshallah ta'ala. Now, you may think, you know, people will find you uh, not funny. People think, what is this? You let them think whatever. <laughs> yeah, you share it. You share it, mashallah. I'm going to share it one more time because I just remembered I have a group. So I'm going to share it on my group here. Look, look, here the link. And then send. Yalla. I'm going to hit the share button one more time. Boys and girls, busy world. <laughs> People have got so much going on on social media. Click this, click that cat video, this video, that funny lol. <laughs> Always. So if you do this, inshallah ta'ala, maybe someone is like asleep or half asleep. And they're scrolling. And the back of their mind, they're like, hmm, I really wish there was a show where I can learn calligraphy. I'm just saying, and maybe they land on this show, and inshallah you get the reward, huh? Writing Quran, inshallah ta'ala, you, you get reward as well. So I'm going to share it one more time, inshallah, on my Facebook. I'm going to share it on my Facebook, and here we go, live with, uh, with Bunny, lol. There you go, share, share, share. <laughs> Facebook is like, <laughs> you going to share with friends or everyone? What do you mean, everyone? <laughs> All right, boys and girls, let's start. Let's start. Barakallahu feekum. So, <clears throat> we stopped at this ayah yesterday. Bima kuntum ta'amalun. This is verse number 43. 
Let's do number 44. Allah Azza wa will tell people in paradise you can eat, drink as you wish, as you desire. Ha! Did you guys ever hear the Prophet alayhi salatu wasalam saying, huh? eat whatever you want and however you want here in this life? No. In Quran, kulu min al-tayyibat. lakum. It's halal. It's tayyib. Eat. But the Prophet alayhi salatu wasalam, he never told us to eat however we want. Eat until you can't even move. You would never hear that. Yeah? <clears throat> Why? Because in this world, boys and girls, in this life, huh, everything is limited. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. Have a look at this. I'm going to show you guys something really cool here. Everything in this life is limited. It starts from somewhere and it has an end. Hereafter, it starts from somewhere and it doesn't have end. Uh -huh. Is that the infinity sign? I don't know. Huh? Not good at math and all these things, but yeah. Ila la nihaya. Subhanallah. Actually, la nihaya. La ni ahaya. Think that there is no end to things. Subhanallah. Now, if you focus with me, huh, I'm going to share something with you, and Shaitan is going to be real upset today. <laughs> Where's Shaitan? He's gone. Boys and girls, have a look at this. Everything in this dunya, whether you like it, whether you enjoy it, whether, whether it's something you dream of, Everything and anything has an end. Huh. This show has an end? Yes, it does. Of course, boys. <laughs> boys and girls. Huh? Read what time we end? We end at 5.30. Alif Lami, 6 o'clock, and we end at 6, 7.30. There's nothing forever. Although, that's what shaitan wants you to think. Although, that's what you think sometimes. You think I'm going to be here forever. Huh? Subhanallah. Hereafter, next life, everything is limitless, unlimited. Now, I give an example to my student a lot of times, and I say, you know, at home you get this Wi-Fi service, yeah? And they say to you, unlimited. Or, for example, you get a contract and it says you can talk to people unlimited amount of minutes. Is it really unlimited? No. There's a limit to how much you can speak in a month. There's a limit to how much... Wi-Fi you can use in a month. Let's say you use it 24-7, huh? Subhanallah. <laughs> Someone send you, uh, I don't know, huh? uh, like a sketch of uh, the entire Titanic or something, <laughs> and you download the entire month. <laughs> You're downloading this massive file, entire month. There is a limit to what you can download in a month, what you can watch in a month. You're going to watch every day, but there's a limit, like 30 days. Can't watch more than that, yeah? So there is a limit to everything in this world. Ah, shaitan doesn't want you to think that. Yeah, shaitan doesn't want you to think that. It's a narration. I'm not sure if it's accurate or not, but the story is nice. There's a great lesson in this. A woman came to huh, Musa alayhi salam, or one of the prophets. They say it like that. And she cried, and she was crying. And he said, what happened? And he, she said, my son died. And he asked, how old was your son? She said, 300 years. Huh? 300 years. Yes, 300 years. So he said to her, what if I told you there will be people who will come after you and they're only going to live for 60 to 70 years? Ah. People in the past, they were bigger, they were taller. Adam was huh, 70 hands, tall, big, yeah? And people used to live longer. SubhanAllah, as we are approaching the end of this world, people are shorter and shorter and shorter and we live short lives. Subhanallah, one of the signs of the end of time that people will be short. So we go, go back to this, and so she said to the Prophet, if people are only going to live 70 years, the entire life is 70 years, and she's comparing it to her son. If her son was 300, he was a baby, it wasn't good. So if a baby is 300 years old, can you imagine the adult? <laughs> Probably thousands of years old. She said, if it's 60 to 70 years, people would, <laughs> they wouldn't even bother. They would just live under the tree and then leave this world. He said, no. He said, for those 60 to 70 years, people will do all sorts of things. 
They will build tall buildings, massive palaces, just for those 60 to 70 years. Subhanallah. So think about this. In Jannah, Allah Azza wa Jalla, kulu wa shabu hani'an. Huh? There is no limit to what you can eat, what you can, subhanallah. So if, I, if you can explore this, if I can show you an example here real quick. When you eat food, guys, if you eat food, imagine the most delicious food in this world. Something that you wouldn't mind overeating. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Astaghfirullah. <coughs> Something you wouldn't mind if you can overeat. <clears throat> you can eat this much. I say to you, today you're going to eat this much. Huh. Add this much. And you say, you know what? Because it's so delicious, yallah, I don't mind. <laughs> and I say to you, ha, ha, a little bit more, a little bit more. And you say, yallah, no problem, yallah. Because <laughs> I like it. There's a limit to what you can eat. And I can guarantee you, if you ever overeat, if you get forced to eat what you enjoy, huh? someone comes to you, you know you're going to eat, you're going to overeat. You start feeling what? Sick. Feel sickness. SubhanAllah. And then, huh? you don't want to eat anymore. Your favorite food, whatever that is, if you eat it every single day, every single day, you'll be put off. True or not? Or maybe you haven't tried it yet. Huh? Maybe you haven't tried it yet. If you do, you're going to be put off of that food. SubhanAllah. In Jannah, you can eat this much, you can keep adding, you can keep adding more, more, and more, and more. There is no limit to what you can, how much you can eat, if you like something. There is no limit to it. You can eat limitless. SubhanAllah. Can you guys imagine that? Now you're going to think, oh, star, your stomach is going to get big, you have to. No. <laughs> there are no toilets in bathroom, or bathrooms in, huh? in Jannah. You don't. Ustad, how? Well, when you get to paradise, you'll figure out. Boys and girls, <clears throat> let's start, inshallah, our calligraphy lesson. Barakallahu feekum. Huh? So this is about, these ayahs are about who? About people who will go to paradise. Bima kuntum ta'amalun. Allah says, then inna kathalika najizil muhsineen. Barakallahu feekum. Let's have a quick look at the translation before we write, so we know what we're writing, yeah? <coughs> Excuse me. Indeed, this is how we reward those who do good deeds. Barakallahu feekum. We're writing this ayah today, and we're going to add another ayah to this ayah. Yalla bismillah. Inna kathalika. Together, boys and girls, my first letter, inshallah, is going to be here. Uh, Hamza. Uh, Hamza. Straight alif. O. Oh. I said Hamza and I'm writing Alif. Well, we'll add Hamza to this, inshallah, later. For now, all I want to see is a straight Alif. We say, in uh, afternoon, I would like you to draw, sorry, Alif, I would like you to draw noon. And then there is an Alif. In uh, Next word. Kaf. Huh, this is a separate word. I'm leaving some gap here. Barakallahu feekum. Kathalika, kaf. Thal. A short alif. Sorry. Short line here. Inna katha. Inna katha. Kathalika. Here is your lamb. And here is your kaf. In Kathalika. In Kathalika. Boys and girls, please pay attention because this mistake huh, is quite repetitive. A lot of students make this mistake. You write one word, you leave a gap, and then you write the next word. Look at this. It's very obvious that these are two separate words because I'm putting the letters together, inshallah. Huh? Yalla. In Kathalika. Next word, Najazil Muhsinin. I'm going to write it here? No. Ah, Naza, who was it? Naza and uh, two of you, right? Naza and uh, I know the name. Najma? No. How, how would I forget that? Anyway, huh? those of you, Naza and your other sister or sibling, huh? listen to me, guys. When you finish this, huh, you leave some gap. So look at this. I'm drawing crosses here, yeah? I'm not going to write here. 
I'm going to leave some gap, and then I'm going to write underneath here. Okay? Look at this. Nice gap here. These letters are not falling onto these letters, you see? Here, nice gap. Leave enough gap, inshallah, before you start writing again. Three, two, one, here. Huh? كذلك نجز المحسنين This is noon. <coughs> this is jim. Naj. Next letter is za. With a short twist at the end. Naj zi. In كذلك نج زي. نج زي بارك الله فيكم. In كذلك نج زي. Next word. المحسنين. المحسنين. Now I'm going to write the word المحسنين on the next line. Ha? Huh? Ma sha Allah. Ha? Huh? The word المحسنين. Beautiful word. Boys and girls. Anyone. Ha? Huh? A silver badge for someone who comes out with the definition of المحسنين or synonyms. What does المحسنين mean? Anyone? Oh, yes. Thank you. Farzana. Naza and Farzana. Thank you, Marwa. Allah bless you. Ah, Ikram. Thank you very much. Naza and Farzana. Yes, thank you very much. Um, Al-Muhsinin. Anyone? The word Al-Muhsinin. Huh? Aha. If you understand Urdu or Hindi, <laughs> you know, sometimes, huh? You tell someone all the good things you did for them. They say in back, Ihsan kar reo. Yeah? Ihsan jata reo. <laughs> you, do you guys know this, huh? Then we're saying believers. Imran is saying good doers. Ha. Huh. Right thing. It's a believer. A believer. Everyone is saying a believer. No. There, there is, there is a, there's a different meaning to it. Huh? People. Who do things in Ihsan, Zainab is saying. MashaAllah, good, good, good. Huh? Ihsan, oh, beauty. Huh? MashaAllah, well done, Zainab. Huh? Well done. I like, I like how Zainab is thinking. Huh? Huh? People who beautify things. It's like people when they do a little bit extra. Huh? So, uh, for example, if I ask you, can you get me a glass of water? And you don't have to. Hmm? You get me a glass of water, you're doing Ihsan. But if you have to, like I'm the grown-up here, and you're the young, I'm the teacher here, go get me a glass of water, you're not doing me any favor, are you? <laughs> yeah? Your parents ask you, get up, go to the kitchen, make me mango milkshake, bring it here with some ice. Huh? You're going to go to the kitchen and bring it back, and probably in your head you're thinking, what? Oh, I'm doing my parents a favor. No, you're not. You're not. <laughs> you're not. You're just doing what your parents told you to do. Aha. Your mom asks you for a glass of water. Or she said to you, can you make me tea? Now you go to the kitchen. And Allah Azza wa Jal have blessed you with some skills. Huh? Huh? MashaAllah. So you go and you make that cake, add some cream, strawberry there. And you take the same time, huh? You take the same time that normal person takes to make tea. Not coming back after three hours with the uh, you know, cake, with the tea. No, no, no. You go within 10 minutes. You do something. You bring your mom, mashallah, the tea she asked for with some cake. Allahu Akbar. This is called what? Ihsan. This is called what? Ihsan. Yeah? So in Urdu, I think in Hindi as well. If someone is like, I did this to you, that to you, and they haven't done anything really. Yeah? But they're just trying to... They're just trying to... Huh? Uh, but, um, the, uh, you know, yeah, butter themselves up. <laughs> yeah, so you haven't done anyone really that much of a favor, but you want to tell them you did so they can, so you can ask them for something. Oh, mom, I did so much today. Yeah, no, not really. You just did what you're supposed to do. <laughs> no, but and I was so tired and I was, I was, uh, I was, felt like I was fainting, but I still did this. Uh, they call what? Ihsan. Uh, you're trying to do ihsan on me. <laughs> ihsan jata reo. Huh? Ihsan kar reo. So here, inna kathalik najzil muhsinin. Allah has is saying, this is how we reward people who, who do ihsan. Ihsan to who? 
Boys and girls, ihsan to who? Ihsan to your parents, ihsan to who? Now let's write the word al muhsin You tell me in the comments, guys. Ihsan to who? al muhsinin Mim. Ha? Ha. al muhsinin MashaAllah. Getting some answers there. Ihsan to who? Allah Azza wa Jal will reward paradise, will give people a great reward, yeah, as Allah described in these ayahs. People who do what? Muhsinin, do ihsan. Muhammad saying to everyone, Salih is saying, Zainab is saying to Allah, everyone to ourselves, everyone, Allah, 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 ha, 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 ha. MashaAllah, tabarakallah. Here, the first answer uh, got there were from Farfura. Well done, Farfura. Ihsan to Allah, Azza wa Jal, boys and girls, huh? Ihsan to Allah. Ihsan to who? To Allah. You see, I saw a comment there, someone saying to yourself, of course, you can do that. Look, do yourself a favor. <laughs> you hear that? Do yourself a favor and don't say anything. You're embarrassing yourself. <laughs> you hear that sort of comment sometimes? Or do yourself a favor and leave the screen, leave this game and go and pray Maghrib. You're doing yourself a favor, not no one else. If you do that, it's good for you. So when your parents, I have to keep seeing this, guys. Huh? When your parents ask you or tell you to do something, you're not doing them a favor. You're doing yourself a favor because if they don't teach you certain things in a certain way, then you're going to end up, yes, yeah? You're going to end up knowing nothing, learning nothing. You're going to become nothing. So you do yourself a favor. You do favor for people. You do favor for your parents, for people you like, your friend. Huh? You give them your friend, you give him a gift. You say, oh, why are you doing you a favor? Ha. Huh. Jannah is for people who do favors for Allah. I'm going to do, I'm going to pray today, but I'm going to, huh? I'm going to focus today. Huh? Listen, guys, I'm going to pray, but I'm going to focus. I'm going to pray today like exceptional salah. Today I'm going to pray and I'm going to read some long surah. Huh? You with me, guys? Why? Who, who are you trying to impress? Allah. Today, my mom asked me to make a tea, but I'm going to make tea, add some cakes, some biscuits, eh, eh, this and that. Why? To impress Allah. Of course, your mom going to be happy. Huh? No, no one's saying make your mom sad. Your mom is going to be happy, but you're impressing Allah Azza wa Jal. You do something great, something big, and you impress Allah Azza wa Jal. That's what you're trying to do. Of course, people will be happy. Everything else follows. Huh? Everything that you do that is good, mashallah, it has benefits. People will benefit, people will smile, people will be happy. All of that is true. But you do it for who? For the sake of Allah Azza wa Jal. By the way, tomorrow I have a very cool lesson for you. Tomorrow, 11 a.m. Boys and girls, tomorrow, 11 a.m. Inshallah ta'ala, 11 a.m. Tomorrow, 11 a.m. UK time, tomorrow, 11 a.m. I've got an amazing lesson for you. Huh? And it's very close to this topic. Tomorrow, uh, we don't do uh, calligraphy in Quran. Tomorrow, we have a hadith. I'm going to be teaching you hadith tomorrow, so why don't you guys do me a favor, inshallah ta'ala, if you have siblings, friend, neighbor, someone, tell them about it, because tomorrow is weekend, and no one can make an excuse and say, I had school, I had madrasa, they can attend. So tomorrow, inshallah ta'ala, tune in at 11 a.m., we're going to make some art and craft together, Surah Al-Fatiha, we're going to learn Surah Al-Fatiha, but most importantly, we're going to learn, inshallah ta'ala, a hadith that we have been learning for the last two weeks, and you guys are going to love this lesson. Al-Muhsinin, Al-Muhsinin. Seen. Oh, that's a big scene. Al Muhsinin. Seen. Seen. Noon. And then we have Ya. And the last letter here is Noon. Al Muhsinin. Wa inna Allaha lama al Muhsinin. Ha. There's an ayah in the Quran. Inna Allaha ma al. Wa inna Allaha lama al Muhsinin. Allah is with people who do ihsan. MashaAllah. May Allah make me and you among those people. Say Ameen. Say Ameen. This is Ayah 44. After this Ayah, we write the same Ayah. And that is, Are you guys ready? One more Ayah. And then after that, we are going to do some quizzes together. Yeah? Loads of quizzes, MashaAllah. Loads of quizzes. MashaAllah. Huh. Mifrah is saying, I've done my calligraphy. No. One more Ayah, Mifrah. Yalla, together. Together. Wailun uh, yawma idhin. So, again, huh? I'm going to leave this line, leave this line, and here, yalla, yalla. 
What's the ayah? Wailun yawma idhin. Wow. Wow. Hanashru. Yep. Yeah. Wailun. Wow. Yeah. Lam. Wailun. Wailun. Yawma idhin. يومئذ يومئذ يا واو with a small twist يومئذ ميم همزة and then we have ذال ويل يوم إذن للمكذبين. Boys and girls, last word إن شاء الله تعالى. Again, I'm gonna move down here. I'm gonna write word للمكذبين. لم لم. And I'm gonna take a short break. Boys and girls, when I come back from the break, I'm gonna finish off this word المكذبين. And this is going to be our verse number forty-five. And after that, we have loads of quizzes for you. Make sure you come back after the break. And also, if you want to recite Surah Al-Kahf, make sure you call in early so we can get you to recite. See you guys after a short break. Assalamu alaikum.
السلام عليكم welcome back boys and girls to Madrasa TV show once again I feel like there's a hole here okay boys and girls let us continue our calligraphy segment we're about to finish this segment and after this segment inshallah I am going to be teaching you Surah Al-Kahf together yeah but we got loads of quizzes for you lot of quizzes yalla let's see let's see I see a lot of you live and active on YouTube there so I'm going to be asking quizzes and I'm going to be taking your answers from our live uh, YouTube live yeah so if you want to participate come over to live our live uh, uh, yes YouTube live just type Iman channel on YouTube and you can answer there inshallah let's continue lil mukadhibin lam lam mim so this word here we've been writing it for a very long time kaf dal sorry dal then we have ba yeah and the last one here is noon mumkin the bin i number this is i number 45 boys and girls time for some quizzes who's ready yalla guys you ready bismillah Bismillah. Right. So, keep your Quran closed because I'm going to ask you loads of quizzes here. I want to find out who answers most of them. I want to see who gets the most amount of badges. So, as soon as you guess the answer, I want you to drop it, inshallah ta'ala, in the comment box. Yalla. Bismillah. So, the first word here is, Inna kathalika. Boys and girls, the word is, Inna kathalika. Okay. Here is a word, in. Can someone tell me where am I supposed to place a dot here? On top of which letter? The black one or the blue one or the red one? Give me a color. Give me a color. Which one? Where am I supposed to place a dot here? Hamza, Noon, Alif. Huh? Where? Where? The blue one, Muhammad Thabit. MashaAllah alayk. Muhammad, you first. After Muhammad, I can see Marwa, Mira, Kuki, and Imran. MashaAllah. Very good, everyone. Well done. Well done. Inna kathalika. So have a look at this. What I'm going to do here, I'm going to add a kasra underneath this alif. Kasra. And then noon with the shadda and a fatha. You guys with me? Inna. Ha. Next word is kathalika. I need to add a dot on top of dal. Kaf with the fatha. Dal has a small alif after it. And has a fatha on top. Lam kasra li in kaf fatha ka. Kathalika. Okay. Let's add this tashkila. Now I'm going to be asking you what should I add, inshallah ta'ala. So I'm going to be asking you. Inna kathalika. Boys and girls, let's have a quick look, inshallah ta'ala, at the verses that we are reciting today. We stopped at verse number 88 last week. This week, inshallah ta'ala, we will continue from verse number 89. We're learning about Dhul Qarnayn, huh? 89, insha'Allah, all the way to verse number, uh, right, 93, barakallahu feekum. 89 to 93 today, huh? 89 to, verse number 89 to 93 from Surah Al-Kahf. Let me just show you these verses. 89, from thumma atba'a sababa, up to, la yakaduna yafqahuna qawla. I hope you guys are ready for that segment. All right, I'm going to get inshallah Hafsa to recite these verses with me and after that, if you can't recite, I'll teach you these verses and if you can recite inshallah, then you can call it and read inshallah. Yalla, yalla, boys and girls, boys and girls, huh, the next word inshallah is Najazi, have a look at this word, the word is Najazi, my question to you is, how many dots do we add on top of letter Z? How many dots do we add to this letter? The word is Najazi. Oh, funny. How comes you here? <laughs> Very healthy, yeah? MashaAllah. Inna kathalika Najazi. One dot. Barakallahu feekum. See loads of comments there. The first one there is from by Ikram. So Ikram, you get a bronze badge. Barakallahu feek Ikram, yeah? We add a dot, a single dot on top of Zah. Single dot on top of Noon. Ha. Ya Allah, Bismillah. 
نون فتح جيم سكون نجا زا كسرا يا سكون زي نجا زي next word here is المحسنين we're gonna add a lot of dots here نون يا نون ما شاء الله تبارك الله ها المحسنين what should I add to seen to make it sound C what should I add to seen to make it sound C محسنين anyone anyone ما شاء الله عليك ها ما شاء الله uh, Muhammad and Imran are the first two who answered correct. Guys, we add a kasra to seen. Muhsinin. Muhsinin. Barakallahu fikum. Next, we have Waylun. Huh? Waylun. Barakallahu fikum. Wafat hayasukun. Way lam dhammatain. Lun. Waylun. This word here is Yawma Ethin. Yawma Ethin. Where am I supposed to add dots in this word? How many? Where? I mean, where am I supposed to place dots here? Yeah. Wow. Meme. Huh. Come on, boys and girls. Where? Under, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah and that. Okay, okay, okay. Under yeah, yeah and that. Farfura, well done. Well done, Farfura. Ha, huh? well done, guys. Yeah, we ma idin. Yeah and that. Yeah, fatha wa sukun. Yeah, min fatha ma. Yeah, we ma. Hamza kasra i. Yeah, we ma i. Thal kasra tain. Then yeah, we ma idin. The last word here is Lil Mukadibin. I have a question for you guys. How many dots do we add to ya? Huh? Lil Mukadibin. Two. Umm Mustafa, you answered first. Well done. Well done. I saw the first answer there was by Umm Mustafa. Okay. Maybe she answered before. Okay, before I even asked. Lil Mukadibin, guys. Wailui Yauma Idin Lil Mim Dhamma Mu Kafat Hadal Shadda Mukadibi Na. Lil Mukadibi Na. Boys and girls, let's have a quick look at what we wrote today. Verse number 44 and 45 from Surah Al Mursalat. Inna Kadalika Najazil Muhsinina. ويل يومئذ للمكذبين بارك الله فيكم جميعا. Boys and girls, it's your chance to become a calligrapher of the day. I haven't for shown you yesterday's calligrapher of the day. Let me show you that right now. Here is the best calligrapher from yesterday. Fadil. I want to know who's the best one today. It's going to be one of you guys. Boys and girls, send me your calligraphy inshallah ta'ala on the number below. Let's pick our final calligrapher of the week. So on Monday, we can change this to a new one. Boys and girls, I'm going to give you a chance. You have a chance. You have time. You can send me your calligraphy later, inshallah ta'ala. But for now, let's go to, let's go to our Quran class. Boys and girls, barakallahu feekum. We'll be learning Surah Al-Kahf today. The first student, inshallah ta'ala, I'm going to be getting Hafsa to recite these verses with me. So let's start the segment. Okay, okay, all right. What I number, <laughs> boys and girls? Okay, <laughs> boys and girls. I think uh, we we uh, <clears throat> okay. Let's start. Inshallah, Taala. Um, let's have a look at the ayahs. Inshallah. So we stopped at ayah number eighty, right? Hmm. Okay. Thank you. All right. We're starting from 81. I had a feeling that we stopped at 81. Okay, I got that ready. Boys and girls, sorry. 81 to 83 today, inshallah ta'ala. 81 to 83. This is what we are learning today. 81 to 83, barakallahu feekum. And here are the ayahs. Have a look at this. Put it here. 81 to 83. Okay? Yalla. Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaykum as-salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.
How are you, Ustaz Hamza? I'm very well, alhamdulillah. And how are you, Hafsa? I'm, ha I'm fine, alhamdulillah. Hafsa, you're the first caller of the day. Excited? Yes. Yalla. We're going to read these verses, inshallah, one word at a time. I'm going to read a word and you're going to repeat after me, okay? Okay. Let's start with Isti'adha and Basmala first. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. Bismillahi ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Bismillahi ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Wa ammal. Wa ammal. Jidaru. Jidaru. Fa kana. Fa kana. Li ghulamayni. Li ghulamayni. Yatimayni. Yatim. Okay. Huh. Yatimayni. Not bad. Ma ma. Yatimayni. Yatimayni. Fil. Fil. Madinati. Madinati. وَكَانَ وَكَانَ تَحْتَهُ تَحْتَهُ كَنْزُ الْتَنْزُ الْتَنْزُ without bouncing lamb كَنْزُ الْتَنْزُ لَهُمَا لهما وكان وكان أبوهما أبوهما صالحا صالحا فأراد فأراد ربك ربك أي يبلغ يبلغ أشدهما أشدهما ويستخرج ويستخرج كنزهما كنزهما رحمة Mir Mir Rabbik Rabbik We stop here Wa ma Wa ma Fa'altuhu Fa'altuhu An An Amri Amri ذلك ذلك تأويل تأويل همزة give me a stronger همزة تأويل تأويل ما لم ما لم تستع تستع ها Change it to ta 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 testi. Testi. Alayhi. Alayhi. Sabra. Sabra. Bounce the back. Sabra. Sabra. Wa yasalunaka. Wa yasalunaka. عن عن ذل ذل قاع 
Parnaini. Parnaini. If we stop, then we say Karnain. 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 Kul. Kul. Saatlu. Saatlu. Alaykum. Alaykum. Minhu. Minhu. Dikru. Mashallah alayki ya Hafsa. A gold badge for you. Can you recite these verses on your own? No. Barakallahu fiki. May Allah bless you. It was an amazing contribution. Boys and girls, we're going to take the next caller, inshallah ta'ala. And if they can't recite these verses, I'm going to teach them these verses. Salaamu alaykum. Wa alaykum as salam. Ali, welcome to the show. How are you? Alhamdulillah. And how are you, Ustad Hamza and Arnab? I'm very well. Arnab was a bit upset yesterday. Do you know why? Why? Arnab was saying Ali and Ibrahim didn't recite. Mm. But today you're going to recite, right? Yes, inshallah. Who's first? Me, Ustad. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Wa ammal. Wa ammal. Jidaru. Jibalu. Fakana. Fakana. Lihulamayni. Leo, may you please start? Lee? Lee? Rulamaini. Rulamaini. Yatimaini. Yatimaini. Filmadinati. Filmadinati. Wakana. Wakana. Wa, 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 kana. Wa, kana. Tahtahu. Tahtan. Kanzul. Kanzun. Lahuma. Lahuma. Wa, kana. Wa, kana. Abuhuma. أبوهما صالحا 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 ها. so the word is صالحا but because we're joining with the next word we say صالحا صالحا فأراد 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 ربك ربهم أه أه listen again ربك ربك أي أي يبلغ يبلغ أشدهما 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 ها uh, let's try again أ أ شدهما شدهما ويستخرج ولا استخرج ويستخرج ويستخرج كنزهما كنزهما رحمة رحمة من ربك من ربك وما 
وما فعلته فجعلته فعلته فعلته ت ضمت فعلته فعلته عن عن امري امري may Allah bless you let's get Ibrahim to complete السلام عليكم Ibrahim how are you today Alhamdulillah how are you Ustaz Hamza Alhamdulillah very well are you ready yes Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Little bit louder Ibrahim Thanika 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 Ta'wilu Ta'wilu ما لم ما لم تستع تستع عليه 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 well done, you got it. Come closer to the phone. Sabara. Sabara. Wa yes. Wa yes. Alunaka. Wa yes. Alunaka. An. An. Zil. Zil. Qarnayni. Qarnayni. It's a big word. Let's break it down, inshallah ta'ala. Qar. Qar. Nayni. Layni. Qul. Qul. Ha, one more time. Qul. Yes, Saatlu Alaikum Alaikum Minhu Minhu Last word, Dhikra Dhikra We have a student, her name is Dhikra Well done, Mashallah Alaik Ibrahim, well done Ali Ibrahim, fantastic. May Allah bless you. We're going to go to the next caller now. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ikram, how are you today? I am fine, alhamdulillah. How are you, Ustaz Hamza? Oh, very well, alhamdulillah. Ikram, can you read these verses on your own? Yes, inshallah. Let's hear your recitation then. Okay. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Wa amma al-gidaru fakana li-ghula mayni yatimayni fil-madi. في المدينة وكان تحته كنز لهما وكان أبوهما صالحا فأراد ربك أن يبلغ فأراد ربك أن يبلغ أشد Dahuma wa yastakhurija wa yastakhurija kan zahuma rahmatan min rabbika wa ma fa'a 
فعلته وما فعلته عن أمر ذلك تأويل ما تأويل ما لم تستطع عليه صبرا ويسألونك عن ذي القرنين كل سأتلو قل سأتلو عليكم منه ذكر منه ذكرا صدق الله العظيم ما شاء الله stay with me stay with me stay with me ذكرا ذكرا that's better ما شاء الله تبارك الله now ب bounces say يا بلغا يا بلغا ويستخرج ويستخرج خا doesn't bounce ب bounces and كاف is whispered May Allah bless you بارك الله فيك بارك الله فيك you got a you got a you got a silver badge well done boys and girls it's time for us to go and pray Maghrib we're gonna pray Maghrib come back and continue after Maghrib I'm still gonna listen to Surah Al-Kahf, a recitation from our students. Verse number 81 to 83, if you can't recite, still call me in. We can at least read one ayah together. Make sure you come back after the break because I want to find out who is the calligrapher and the reciter of the day. We're going to find that out, inshallah ta'ala, after the break. Boys and girls, come back. And if you haven't sent me your calligraphy yet, do send it to me on the WhatsApp number below. Send me your calligraphy, send me your calligraphy. Let me find out who's the best one, inshallah. Boys and girls, we're going to take a short break, come back, and after the break, we shall continue. Verse number 81 to 83 from Surah Al-Kahf and loads of calligraphies. After a short break, stay with us. Make sure you come back after the break. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs>
Assalamu alaikum boys and girls, welcome back to Madrasa TV show once again. We're going to go to our next caller now. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Muhammad Thabit, Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. How are you, Ustad Hamda? I'm very well, alhamdulillah. And how are you, Muhammad? I am fine, alhamdulillah. حياك الله تفضل يا محمد اوكي ان شاء الله اعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم و السلام عليك يا باشا اللي بعد والسلام عليكم السلام عليكم اه اي واز تراين تو ساي نيكست وان ان عربي السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام ويلكم تو ذا شو از ات عبد الرزاق ذس از عبد الرزاق تفضل عبد الرزاق بسم الله اوكي okay, ان شاء الله أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وأما الجدار فكان لغلامين يتيمين في المدينة وكان تحته كنز لهما وكان تحته كنز لهما وكان أبوهما صالحا فأراد ربك أن يبلغا أن يبلغا أشد أشدهما ويستخرجا كنزهما رحمة من ربك وما فعلته عن أمري ذلك تأويل ما لم تستطع عليه صبرا ويسألونك عن ذي القرنين قل سأتلو عليكم منه ذكرا ما شاء الله تبارك الله عليك اكسترا اوردنري عبد الرزاق اكسترا اوردنري رحيمه السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام رحيمه هاو ار يو توداي اي ام فاين الحمد لله رحيمه وعبد الرزاق فاست توداي وات هابن 
Um, I just wanted him to be first. Okay. All right. Let's hear your recitation. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Inshallah. Bismillah. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Wa amma al-jidar fa kana li ghulamayni yatimayni fi al-madina. وكان تحته كنز لهما وكان أبوهما صالحا فأراد ربك أن يبلغ أشدهما ويستخرجا كنزهما رحمة من ربك وما فعلته عن أمري ذلك تأويل ما لم تستطع عليه صبرا ويسألونك عن ذي القرنين قل سأتلو عليكم منه ذكرا Allah, tabarakallah. Ah, let's focus on this word. This is not tastati'. Tastati'. Without ta. The one before it was tastati'. MashaAllah alayki ya rahima. Zayd would be last. Assalamu alaykum. Zayd, assalamu alaykum. Assalamu alaykum. Wa alaykum assalam. How are you, Zayd? Good. Alhamdulillah. Zaid, are you ready? Yes. Are you reading on your own or with me? With you. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Nice and loud. Wa ammal. جدار جدار فكان فكان بغلامين بغلامين يتيمين يتيمين في ال مدينة مدينة وكان وكان تحته تحته كنز كنز ها the word is كنز Huh? Means treasure. Kanzul. Kanzul. Lahuma. Lahuma. Wa kana. Wa kana. Abuhuma. Abuhuma. Saliha. صالحا 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 فأراد فأراد ربك ربك أي أي يبلغ أشدهما أشدهما ويستخرج ويستخرج 
Frida. Quinze arruma. Quinze arruma. Rahmatam. Rahmatam. Mir Rabbik. Mir Rabbik. Wama. Wama. Fa'altuhu. عن أمري عن أمري ذلك ذلك تأويل تأويل ما لم ما لم تستع تستع عليه عليه صبرا May Allah bless you. Amazing. Amazing. MashaAllah, tabarakallah. Boys and girls, we're going to have a look at some of the beautiful calligraphies and let's find out who's the best one. Let's find out who's the best one. Barakallahu fikum. The first one I see here is, 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 MashaAllah, tabarakallah. Yeah. Our first calligrapher here is, uh, looks like this is from, haha, <laughs> come on. They forgot to add their name. What a beautiful work, but I forgot to write the name. No. All right, let's not upset anyone. Bronze badge. Who did this? Who was this? I can see Abdul Wahid. Abdul Wahid, not bad. Not bad, Abdul Wahid. Very nice. May Allah bless you. Keep up the good work. Who is this? Uh, Zaid. Uh, looks like. Yeah, it looks like Zaid. Zaid something. MashaAllah, Alex. Zaid? Zaid? Keep it up, keep it up. Ahmad, mashallah, kadhalika najizil muhsinin, mashallah, tabarakallah alayka, Ahmad. Ah, beautiful, beautiful colors. Safra, Allah, tabarakallah, Safra, well done, Safra. Ha, ah, very creative Safra. Ha, ah, ah, no, 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 silver bat, there's a mistake here. We don't put mukaddi and bean, mm, we don't break the word like this, but you did very well. Imran. May Allah bless you. Let's look at the colors. MashaAllah alayk. MashaAllah alayk ya Imran. Next one here we have Latifa. <coughs> Latifa. May Allah bless you. Amazing work. MashaAllah tabarakallah alayk. Wailuyawma. That's two lambs. Supposed to be one lamb. Yeah, one lamb. And who is this? Farzana, MashaAllah. Farzana. Beautiful, beautiful, mashallah, tabarakallah. Keep it up, keep it up. And here we have Naza. I can see your name inside the tree. Well done, Naza. Well done, well done, mashallah, mashallah. This is Zainab from South Africa. We can see a camel, we can see bunny on top of the camel, and the water, and the tree, and the sun, and so many other things. Ooh, mashallah, mashallah. Asma. Asma. One eye missing. Why is it missing? Where is it gone? Have a look at this one, mashallah, tabarakallah. This is uh, Fatima. May Allah bless you, Fatima. May Allah bless you. Look at the bead, mashallah. No mistakes. I see no mistakes. Next we have Fatima Hussein, mashallah, tabarakallah, Fatima. One eye is missing, but you know what? This is good. This is very good. Next we have, uh, next we have uh, Hamana Hussein or Jumana Hussein. Huh? Jumana Hussein. Jumana Hussein, you get a silver badge. And here we have Farfura. Ya Farfura, mashallah alayk ya Farfura. Saliha, Saliha, mashallah. Saliha, although this is so beautiful, what happened to the dot on the dal? Ha. The dot on the dal is missing. Aman, Saliha. May Allah bless you. Hafsa Amir, may Allah bless you. Hafsa Amir, beautiful, beautiful. 
Oh, how comes a lot of you are missing one eye, Fatiha? Where is the second eye, Fatiha? <laughs> Maybe you guys got tired, huh? Maymuna, 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 may Allah bless you. Keep it up, keep it up. Nice, nice, nice. Mashallah, mashallah, loving it. Muhammad Thabit, mashallah alayka Muhammad, huh? Guys, takes time, effort to uh, write something like this. Muhammad, may Allah bless you. Amazing. Ooh, this is Zuha. Mashallah, tabarakallah, ya Zuha. Very, very nice, mashallah. And here we have Zahra Iman. Is it? Is that your name or are you trying to say Iman Channel? Okay, mashallah, tabarakallah. I'm going to quickly have to pick, inshallah, one of you as a calligrapher, one of you as a reciter of the day, boys and girls. Let's do that real quick. Bismillah. Here comes, here comes, here comes the reciter of the day. Abdul Razak. Well done, barakallahu feek. And let's have a quick look at our calligrapher of the day. And that is... Fatima is the calligrapher of the day. Boys and girls, tomorrow, 11 a.m., tune in, inshallah. We're going to have some amazing lesson. We're going to make art and craft, and we're going to learn Surah Al-Fatiha. Now, a lot of you can't recite Surah Al-Kahf, and you say, Ustad, can I recite easy Surah? Tomorrow, we're reciting Surah Al-Fatiha. You can all join me, inshallah ta'ala, tomorrow, 11 a.m. Remember me in your du'as, and I'll see you tomorrow. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh.